look at it when you use any syntax checker or linter that takes a source file and produces warning or error messages and run it in the background. It then marks these warnings and errors in the file without actually compiling the file. This can be configured per language. Let's take a look at a Python example. With a Python file up, let's go to Document, Python Options. Then we'll slide down to Live Air Profiles. Here we can see that there are profiles for two different linters set up. We're going to leave the default profile to automatic and just click Enable to turn it on. Notice that now we have warnings in our Python file. Let's try introducing a simple indentation error. You may have noticed that all the warnings went away. This is actually PyLint's behavior to not show warnings when there are errors. If we remove the error, you'll see that the warnings come back. This uses the existing error parsing system to classify tool output into error, warnings, and info messages. For more, go to Tools, Options, Tools, Configure Air Parsing. Here you can see where regular expressions were added for PyLint. Download your free trial today. Go to www.slickitit.com slash trial.